Hey everyone, it's Michael here at Home Health Success Academy and welcome to another one of our Marketing Mistakes video series. And in this video, this has got to be one of the biggest problems and largest mistakes that a lot of home health agencies that I've worked with or that I've met who are struggling is committing. And that is not having a marketing team, right? So, you know, you must have encountered this at one point, known somebody or tried to work for someone. And here's the thing, right? I've gone to so many agencies and if they're struggling, if they're like, you know, I can't get 30 patients or, you know, I can't make this level of things. And, and most of the time is I start thinking, I had 50% chance I bet you they don't have a marketing team. And when I asked that question, I said, who's your marketers? And they're going to say, well, I do marketing. I'm like, well, aren't you the owner of the company? And they'll say, yes. Aren't you the administrator of the company as well? Well, she's like, yes. Don't you do payroll as well? Yes. Do you do scheduling? Yes. Right? So these are the jack of all trades, but a master of none. Okay? So if you're doing all these things, if you're spending time to do payroll, if you're spending time to do uh, assignments and scheduling, if you're still doing answering of phone calls, Look, if you're in the beginning stage of your company, I truly understand that that's perfectly fine. You're trying to bootstrap it. You're trying to save some money. But if you really want to grow up and level up on your agencies, on your company, you must have a marketing team. Okay, then, then you're going to hear a lot of things that comes up. Well, Michael, you know, I've hired a marketer before and it just didn't work out. I paid them money. Three months later, there's no patience. And is that going to happen? Of course. But that's where you actually should you know, as a company owner, I'm speaking to the owners here, I'm speaking to the administrators here. Um, that's when you have to make sure that you have a, a, a real training program available for your marketers so that they have something, a base, a process that they should follow to be able to market your company. And then you need to be able to be put, to be on point and seeing are they doing what they're supposed to be doing. That's why we work with a lot of agencies because they don't even have time to monitor their marketers and we do it for them and we do the training for them. But if you guys are doing it on your own, I, I truly understand that's fine. But you, if you want to grow, you need to bring in a marketer, right? You need a full-time marketer. That's, that's pretty much what I'm just trying to say here. A full-time marketer who's trained, who knows what they're doing, okay? And the reason why you need a full-time marketer is because whatever your census is right now, what you have in your company right now is a result of what you're doing at this moment. And then if all of a sudden you expect yourself to double in size, double in referrals, and you're still doing the same exact thing, well then that's gonna create problems. So you need to be able to have a marketing team. Now, now there's, a, there's a strategy where if you are just a, your own self, your own owner, and you wanna be able to increase your referrals, we can actually show you how to be able to do that where you are doing everything on your own and we can get you to a certain level that you want. But in this video, we're just talking about marketing and making sure you have a marketing team. So if you decide to bring in a marketer, train them, make sure that they know what they're doing, give them everything that they need to be able to launch your company, then you're gonna see an increase for that. And then if you want to double that again, what that one marketer is doing and bring in another marketer, right? And you're going to say, well, Michael, it's going to cost me money to hire a marketer. Yes, it's going to cost you money. Everything's going to cost you money when you're trying to brand your company, when you're trying to market your services. But if you have a trained marketer who can actually, you know, make sense of what you're paying them because they're bringing in a higher revenue, then right there alone, it's worth having that marketer. And if you can double that, you can double the income, double the intake of type of patients or clients or whoever you're servicing. So I want you guys to start thinking in that manner that don't think about this, the spending, but think about the earnings that you can make. And to be able to make sure that you're making money, making earnings, you better make sure that this person who you're sending out there, who you're paying, who you're spending money in is trained so that they can go out there and make the money for your company and bring in the clients that you need to service. So not having a marketing team can actually be detrimental for your organization and you should start looking about making sure that you bring in the right people, train them, make sure that they, they're checking up on you, making sure that you watch them, 
you know, there's a lot of different things to be able to handle marketers. And so we actually have a video series if you want later on, how to be able to find the right top notch marketer in your area. We hope that you actually keep on watching our videos. This is Mike with Home Health Success Academy. Always visit us at 10xpatientreferral.com and always understand that home health marketing is easy when you know what you're doing.